Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, The Wealthy Mindset. It's yours truly, Money Making Mitch, or as some of my followers call me, Triple M Mitch. Uh, <laughs> this is not financial advice. Please do your own due diligence and research. Boy, do I have a banger for you guys this morning. Remember yesterday I was talking about Neo, what they did and that they're using the money for research and development. When a company is burning through cash for the wrong reasons, then you have to panic and worry. But I spoke about it in my last video that they're using the money for research and development, for building factories, for growing. And boy, some news came out this morning that just, it blew me away. So Neo unveils first in-house developed chip Remember I was talking about that, the, the in-house chips? Mass production to begin in October. In October, guys, the Yangjian chip will allow NIO to save about $100 per vehicle and recover its development costs in about a year, said William Lee. So <laughs> I hope they start selling these chips to other manufacturers as well to generate revenue. Not just yet, though. But remember, in my last video, I talk about them using funding for R&D, so it is not a waste. This chip will officially begin mass production next month to reduce cost of a core component. And I believe these chips will be used in their LiDAR. Also, NEO's first chip, a LiDAR main control chip, will go into mass production. So... <laughs> A lot of people who were panicking and selling yesterday, remember we were buying the dip guys and the market hasn't digested this news yet. I don't think a lot of people even know about this yet because it's down, Neo is down pre-market again. But this is what I was telling you guys when all these people crapping their pants, looking at the stock price and not what the company is doing this is uneducated investors. People with the investor mindset, like most of you guys who are following my channel, you are buying the dip because you're looking at what the company is doing, not what the stock price is doing. And eventually, we will be greatly rewarded. I truly believe that, guys. <clears throat> I also want to thank, there's a follower on my channel. His name is Fear 320 Fairway. I, I want to thank you, buddy. Um, you brought some news to me yesterday that spoke about what UXI and Oxen is doing. And remember I told you guys to keep your eye on this company. Um, one of my followers said it's really painful. They did a reverse split on us not that long ago. And yes, it was painful, but I started averaging down again. I have over 3000 shares of this company. So this is the Chinese Carvana and again uh, 320 fairway I want to thank you the stock price spiked yesterday and this is a good example of why you need to hold when you believe in a company this is a company like I said William Lee invested I think over 300 million dollars in them and the company they are the Chinese leading car retailer they announced yesterday that it has entered into an equity investment agreement with Haifei Construction, whereby they will invest up to 1.5 billion RMB into Oxen over the next decade. So we have funding for the next decade. This investment will not dilute Oxen shares. So some people pronounce it as Ocean. Um, so this will not dilute our shares. We're getting funding. This is huge. This is amazing. And I think Haife is a, is a government subsidiary. So they own, but it's a government entity. This is really, really cool, man. Um, remember, like I said, they did a stock split on us before. Uh, the, it will be used for <clears throat> Changfeng Superstore, which showcases up to 10,000 vehicles. So, so the money will be used to, for further developing and growing the Changfeng Superstore. It is already 4,500 square meters. So like I said, guys, this is the Chinese version of Carvana. And again, I want you guys to see what's happening here. William Lee connection again, guys. 
I hope you guys found this video informational. And see, I told you guys this, when you believe in a company, average down. Even though Ocean did a reverse split on me and it was painful, I have continued averaging down on them. The stock made a big spike yesterday and then there was a big sell-off, but it's up pre-market again a little bit. I expect this company to be a behemoth in the future. And remember I told you guys, I only do videos on companies I believe in. I hope you guys found this video informational. If you do guys, give it a thumbs up. It'll help encourage me to keep doing videos for you guys. If you haven't yet subscribed, you might want to think about doing so. Guys, all those uneducated investors who were selling yesterday, now they're going to be panicking when they find out about this chip news and trying to jump back in. On this channel, we get rich or we die trying.